Assalamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. Today is another slime video. Yes, in today's video we're going to be mixing nail art shredded glitter into clear slime. So let's get started. So everyone, let's prepare the clear slime first. I'm just taking a tablespoon of clear, good quality, great quality PVA glue. And then I'm going to be adding a few drops of liquid Tide in this. You can add borax solution if you have some. Mix it thoroughly. This is going to be very cloudy and full of bubbles because of all the mixing. But if you leave it in the container and leave it for a few days, it's going to become totally clear. If you don't want to make your own slime, that's totally fine. Just go and buy a big batch of clear slime ready-made from the store. Okay, so this part is done. Okay, on to the next part. Now to the clear slimes, you're going to be adding different colors of this Mylar confetti or Mylar glitter. I would not classify this as glitter because glitter is more fine. This would be considered confetti because it's just larger pieces. Okay, so I got this from Marcus Bavazi, which is Bavazi Center. This place is right in front of Al-Bashawat, one of my most favorite places. So this was 5 reals, and as you can see, they have 12 shades of this Mylar confetti. It's also known as cellophane shredded glitter, uh, shattered glitter, I don't know, they have so many names for the same things. But I feel like whatever name you call it, it is just so stunning. So here we have a mix of holographic and iridescent confetti. Now let's mix all of these stunning Mylar confetti shreds into clear slime. So today's topic is going to be on bullying. What is bullying? Bullying is acting in ways that scare or harm another person. People who bully usually pick on someone repeatedly, once thought of as simply a rite of passage or relatively harmless behavior that helps build people's character. Bullying is known to have long-lasting harmful effects for both the victim and the bully but mostly for the victim. Screw the bully. Now, do you bully others? Okay, sometimes what you think teasing someone is really something more. Maybe you think the person deserves it. Maybe you think they don't mind. Maybe you're not sure, but you just don't feel right about the way you treat someone. Answering these questions may help clarify things for you. First of all, is it teasing? Now, if it's just teasing, then everyone should be having fun with it and nobody feels hurt, right? Is everyone involved up for it? Ask yourself, who's laughing? If the answer isn't everyone, then something more is probably happening. Is it just a conflict? No, conflict isn't planned. It just happens sometimes when people get angry with each other. Both parties are upset and no one is having fun. But there's a possible solution to the disagreement. Ask yourself, can we work it out? If so, that means there is equal power among you rather than you abusing your power over someone else. Now, is it a mean moment? It's inevitable that sometimes people will be mean and nasty towards each other. But if it's just a mean moment, then it's an isolated event. It might be an emotional reaction to something. Ask yourself, will it blow over? If it's repeated and ongoing aggression against someone, then it's more than just a one-off. Now. Is it bullying? Is your behavior planned, on purpose, ongoing, and intended to hurt the person? Ask yourself, are you having low self-esteem? Are you having a lack of remorse or failing to recognize your behavior as a problem? Are you feeling angry or frustrated? Are you struggling socially? Are you being the victim of bullying yourself and taking out on someone else? Does this sound like you? It takes courage to recognize you might not be treating others with respect and to do something about it. Respect for yourself and other people matters and our differences are something to celebrate, not make fun of and cause shame over. Now let's talk about the types of bullying. Now there are three types of bullying. We have verbal bullying. It is saying or writing mean things. Verbal bullying includes teasing, name calling, inappropriate comments, taunting, threatening to cause harm. Social bullying, sometimes referred to as relational bullying, involves hurting someone's reputation or relationships. Social bullying includes leaving someone out on purpose, telling other people not to be friends with someone, spreading rumors about someone, embarrassing someone in public. <coughs> Third one is physical bullying involves hurting a person's body or possessions. Physical bullying includes hitting, kicking, pinching, spitting, tripping, pushing, taking or breaking someone's things, making mean or rude hand gestures. So what kind of people are bullies? Well, both guys and girls can be bullies. 
Bullies may be outgoing and aggressive. This kind of bully might make fun of you to your face or physically hurt you. They can be quiet and sneaky. This kind of bully might try to manipulate in secret. They might anonymously start a damaging rumor just to see what happens. You know, for funsies. Friendly and fake, this kind of bully might pretend to be your friend so that you tell them things, but then do hurtful things behind your back. Many bullies are a lot alike. They like to be in control of others, are focused on themselves, mostly narcissistic, have poor social skills, and have a hard time getting along with people, might not care about people or lack empathy, are often insecure, and bully others to make themselves feel better. Some bullies don't understand normal social emotions like guilt, empathy, compassion, or remorse. A message for the one who is being targeted. You may be convinced there is something wrong with you or you deserve this or that even if you don't deserve it, there's no hope of it stopping. Where there's people, there is insecurity. People form groups. People who don't find a group get targeted. You may feel like the cause of this bullying will never end. It will, inshallah. Allah will turn everything in your favor if you just ask and pray on it. If you are a target, know this. You have been noticed for who you really are. No mask will hide it afterwards because you are genuine and clicks fear individualism. Bullies live daily behind masks, constantly trying to keep their place in the pecking order. Don't you dare waste further time trying to get into a group. Tell everyone possible about the bullying that can support you. Keep on sharing your story until someone stops the bullying. You are stronger, more independent than those bullies ever will be. They know that and they try to squash that. If they really think they are God's gift to the world, their delusion will be smashed worse than you already are as they move on to the next chapter of the denial that is their toxic life. This is for you. Yes, you, the survivor. You're doing better than you think you are. I'm so proud of you. Keep going. You've got this. I am going to store my sparkly slimes into this butterfly plastic clear multi-purpose storage container. This has gridded compartments to keep slimes organized. Let's add in our magical slimes. I've given them magical names as well. Shredded Disco Ball, which is silver. Shredded Tinkerbell, sorry Tinkerbell. Light green. Shredded Robin Egg, light blue. Shredded Barbie, pinkish purple. Shredded Oscar, gold. Shredded Lilac, purple. Shredded Sunshine, sunshine. sunshine yellow. Shredded Emerald, dark green. Shredded Blues Notes, dark blue. Shredded Fuchsia, dark pink. Shredded Cotton Candy, light pink. Shredded Unicorn, white. I use these letter stickers which are ideal for embellishing just about everything. The sparkling names will add shiny looks to your lovely items. Now these are self-adhesive jeweled bling letters, easy to peel and use. Transform plain and boring to fun and eye-catching and add the pizzazz and glamour that is just right for your wind down de-stress session. So everyone, if you really enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press the bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post. Leave a constructive comment and share this video. I know, I know, it's a lot to do, but I'll really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah Hafiz. Bye! Jazakallah khair, thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here. Check it out.